Hello dear aspirants, this is Sushma, Nursing Officer at Ames Bibinagar. So, welcome you all to the KNU Academy YouTube channel classes. So, today we are going to discuss regarding VIP score. I hope so, everybody knows regarding this tool. So, VIP score means Visual Infusion Plebiety Score. To assess the patency of the IV cannulation site, we will use this score to assess the patency of the IV cannulation site. So, visual means what we see. Infusion means through that IV cannulation site. Phlebitis means everybody knows when there is a word. Itis means inflammation. Phlebitis means inflammation of the vein. So, in that we have 6 stages. Okay. 0 to 5 we will give the scorings. Okay. When we will give 0 score means while, while assessing the pat patency of the IV cannulation site. So, when we will give 0 means there is IV site appears healthy. There is no signs and symptoms of phlebitis. Then we will give it as 0 score. Okay. In that there is no signs and symptoms of phlebitis. Okay. Intervention what we need to supposed to do means we should observe the cannula because there is no need to change the cannulation site. The IV site is healthy. So, when we, the next when we will give the score 1 means possible first sign of phlebitis. There is a first possible sign of phlebitis. That time we will give the score as 1. In that signs and symptoms we will see as one of the following will be evident. Evidence means we can see that. So, one of the following not both any one of the following. Slight pain at the IV site. When we touch the IV site, the patient will complain of pain. Okay. Or else redness near the IV site. There will be a redness near the IV site, IV cannulation site. In that, what we supposed to do, our intervention should be observe the cannula. We can change. Uh, it's not mandatory. We can change as your wish. But we should not uh, go into progression of the stages. In If... If we observe a uh, cannulation site, it will be in second uh, score 1 means in second stage means we recannulate the cannula site. Okay, We should avoid progressing into the third stage, fourth stage and all. Okay? So next when we give score 2 means in third stage uh, early sign of phlebitis. There will be early, early sign first. Okay, early means first. Signs and symptoms will be any two of the following are evident in these three symptoms any two will be evident pain erythema or swelling in these three if any two pain and erythema is there means we can give it score as two okay always remember no need to confuse the symptoms signs and symptoms will keep on adding you know progressing stages so here also pain is there redness is there here also pain and redness is there so swelling will will be adding in this stage okay so in this we should recite the cannulas site if we not uh, reciting means go into the progression to early stages and it will lead to complication to the patient okay next stage that is score 3 when we will give score 3 means there is a medium stage of phlebitis medium stage of inflammation of the vein in that what we observe signs and symptoms means all of the following are evident. Evidence means evident means which we can see, observe. Okay. So all of the following, these three also we can see. Okay. Pain along the path of the cannula. In first uh, stage, uh, previously I told the pain. When we touch the patient will complain of pain. In this pain along the path of the cannula side, the cannula side path, when we touch forward now, there will be a pain along that path. Okay. And erythema means redness. In duration. In duration means uh, there is a bulging like you know right after giving BCG vac vaccine it should endure means we observe in duration. And one more example is, uh, example is when we give a uh, test dose any antibiotic test dose will give you know uh, also we will see the in duration. In duration means uh, like a, in a particular uh, diameter there will be a swelling type kind of okay. So, in that what we do, our intervention is always we should change the cannula, okay. Recite the cannula and consider treatment. Based on the severity of symptoms, they will consider the treatment. Whether they should give a cold application or any ointment or any further treatment. Based on that symptoms, they will consider. Consider means it's not mandatory to give a treatment. 
but they can give based on the symptoms okay next score is 4 when we will give score 4 means in that next stage there is advanced stage of thrombophlebitis this is medium it if we leave the cannula into it, then it will be uh, advanced stage of thrombophlebitis or a start of thrombophlebitis. Thrombo means blood clot. Clot formation in the clot formation in the vein. Okay. So that will cause the inflammation. Yeah. So in that signs and symptoms, may, what we observe means all of the following are evident and ex ex extensive. Extensive means in a large area. Okay. So, pain along the path of the cannula, same here also. And here also erythema will be there. In this stage also erythema will be there. Same induration will be there. Induration will be there. Okay. Next, in this uh, score 4, in this stage, we uh, will see a palpable venous cord. When we, if we see palpable venous cord, means we will give score as 4. Along with these symptoms, along with all the 4 symptoms. Venous, palpable venous cord means... Uh, there is a firmness in the vein. There will be hard structure because of the thrombophlebitis. So that is called palpable. So that we can palpate that one. Palpable venous cord we can observe in this stage. So our intervention should be recite the cannula. Means we must have to change the cannula and consider treatment. And this also based on the severity. Will uh, The treatment will depend. Uh, I mean uh, practitioner will decide whether should give treatment or not. Based on the severity of the symptoms okay next score 5 this is the last uh, stage when we give score 5 means advanced stage of thrombophlebitis there is a progressment in the thrombophlebitis advanced stage so in that all of the following signs, signs are evident and ex extensive means all in a large area so pain along the path of the cannula same as above and erythema Enduration also same here also we can observe and palpable venous cord also we can observe in this. We can observe is pyrexia. Pyrexia means as you all know fever. If there is a phlebitis inflammation it's always accompanied with pyrexia okay. Because in this is advanced stage of thrombophlebitis so it will cause the pyrexia. In that our intervention should be initiate the treatment and recite the cannula. We must recite the cannula, of course, and initiate the treatment here. We'll just consider treatment based on symptoms we should give or not. It depends on the doctor or a practitioner. So, uh, in this advanced stage, we must have to initiate the treatment. Otherwise, this thrombus formation will cause more complication to the patients. Okay. So, these all 0 to 5 stages we observe. In 0 and 1, if you're giving score 0 and 1 means it's not man mandatory to change the cannula, okay. In If we are giving uh, score 1 means we can change but it is not mandatory in 0, 1. But when it progresses into the second, when we uh, give uh, score uh, 2, 2 means we have to change the cannula site. We, we should recannulate when we give the score 2. We should avoid progressing into these stages, okay. In second, when we are uh, giving the score 2 means in that stage only, we should recite the cannula, okay. So, thank you. Uh, I hope this video is useful for you. Thank you, Anandal. Jai Hind.